you guys keep insisting Islamophobia is not a very accurate term, but isn't feminism technically a very inaccurate term too? Feminism has been used to shield anti-male narratives. Um, well, okay, so I think you're misunderstanding the difference between misusing a label and what it means. Uh, hold on a second. Um, so, yeah, so like when we say when the problem that we have with Islamophobia is not the misuse. Um, it's not. Okay, so you're, com you're confusing two, two completely different things, okay? Islamophobia sometimes refers to something that is genuinely needs referring to, but with the wrong terminology. We have a semantic issue. We, we think it should be called anti-Muslim bigotry, okay? Um, we think the labeling of it is problematic because it makes it seem like attacking Islam is an issue, where attacking Islam is not an issue, attacking Muslims is a, is a problem. So anti-Muslim bigotry would be a better term to use, right? Um, with feminism, the, the term itself doesn't have an issue because if you are for women's rights, the fem the fem in feminism is technically referring to the right thing. So the, the wording is not the issue. What you're having with the problem that you ha seem to be having with feminism it's what it's used for, not the not the semantics of it, but the usage of it, right? So Islamophobia, on the other hand, is referring to something that we support it being referred to, like anti-Muslim bigotry being highlighted is something that we want it to be highlighted, right? Feminism, you're saying it's being misused for something that shouldn't even be used, okay? So your problem with it is completely different from what we the problem that we have with Islamophobia. However, I would challenge your assertion here as well because i think if, uh, when you have anti-male narratives um, from feminist groups that gets a lot more attention than what most feminism is about because it's disgusting like anti-male narratives is absolutely horrible and disgusting and it's but it gets a lot more attention right it just it's so it's gross um and but it's more interesting so b because anti-male narratives gets more attention, you come up with this understanding that most feminists or many feminists are anti-male, but, but they're not. Um, feminism is just, most of feminism still to this day is just equality of rights between different genders. That's all it is. And I support that. However, you wouldn't get that impression if you just look at what narratives from feminist groups gets highlighted the most, which will give you a different understanding of what it is about, okay? But yeah, I'm against anti-male narratives. That's absolute sexism. And I am, a, I am a man's rights activist and a feminist at the same time. And that is not a contradiction, okay? I'm a man's rights activist and a feminist at the same time, okay? There is no contradiction in that. Atheist Republic needs your help. We have been the target of many legal attacks by Hindu nationalists ever since our founder, Armin Avabi, blasphemed against Hindu deities. We have retained legal counsel to help us defend our access to our community in India. We have started a fundraiser that will help us afford to tackle many legal issues, including judicial harassment and censorship. Whatever you can contribute will go a long ways in helping us in this fight. Link in the description below.